All right, good morning from West Suckle, Texas, America. Today we are here at Teddy's Barbecue. We came to check out their uh, brunch or breakfast. breakfast. Some chicharron, some barbacoa, and some brisket. Let's check it out. Where's the coffee? Teddy's Barbecue opened up in 2019, and although they are only five years old, they have quickly become a go-to yeah. for barbecue aficionados here in the RGV. Texas Monthly voted them a top 50 must-visit barbecue joint in the state of Texas. The New York Times recently voted them a top 20 barbecue joint in the state of Texas. Their barbecue is always on point. Some of the best brisket that you're going to have, best mac and cheese that you're going to have, and their ribs are to die for. Today we're visiting to try out their breakfast. We had a friend who sent us a picture, and we're going to find out today if it's going to taste as good as it looked. Gonna be enjoying the outdoors today. Enjoy this beautiful, cold, rainy weather. The good thing about Teddy is they got a great setup back here. I didn't even know they had the ah, but it's not a hard cover. The tables are wet, man. Tienes toalla or no? Got a towel in the truck? All right, little rags are gonna have to do. A ver qué tanto se seca aquí. Yeah. The kids are wearing this ones. Yeah. The chowder kids are wearing this ones. Tino's got a little beanie. Ah, se está secando poquito. Got a beanie. <laughs> and we got ourselves a little buddy heater porque está frito. What kind of place is this? The human bean. Where's that? It's uh on Olana. Next to the Whataburger on Olana oh, and McCall. Okay. Yeah. Well, yeah. it's on Olana. Yeah. A little further down from Starbucks. Tino was kind enough to get us a coffee this morning. Came with a little roasted bean arriba. Ta, con ganas eso. Thank you, Tino. You're very oh, welcome. Man, eee, this thing's coming in handy, man. Yeah, yeah it feels good, right? Yeah. I'm glad yeah. you brought it. It was good. All right. Check that out. So we got some chicharrones, some brisket. Scrambled eggs, barbacoa, potatoes, and menudo. OJ, you, you asked for a specialty. Well, what did you ask I less of or more of? Just brisket and chicharron because I'm not a big fan of barbacoa. Dude, barbacoa is legit, man. I've had it very few hey, times where I've actually beans. liked it. Tino just didn't come with beans. Oh, yeah. I don't know what happened there. Maybe he asked for no beans. Ooh, hoo, hoo, look at that. That is pretty. Oh, I'm not going to eat the rest of the week with this, man. <laughs> All right. First thing that I'm going to try out today is the brisket. Get a bigger piece here. Ooh, check it It's juicy. Oh, my God. Butter's like I've always good. said, there's good brisket and there's bad brisket. This is good brisket. Bark that in bueno. Oh, and it's juicy, man. All right, Tino, what are you trying out? Uh, first thing I'm gonna try out is to make it a little barbacoa taco. Let's check this out. And the tortillas are like beef, beef fat, right? Mm-hmm. Barbacoa is good. Tender. Has a little smoke to it. <laughs> Sounds so savoring it, man. Yeah, brisket is really good. Tino, you got it. Tino, you got to try out some of the chicharron. Give me, give me. Let's check it give out. Give me an action shot right there with chicharron. Looks good, man. 
Mmm. Yeah, it's real good. The chicharron's really tasty. Salsa's really good. Flavorful, tender. Has a nice, nice taste to it. Yeah, chicharron looks really, really good. I'm gonna try the chicharron now. Mmm. She was gonna come back, right? She said, the dude, salsa is. Look. Está bien cocida. Tastes good. Mm hmm. Try some of the baracoa. I haven't tried the baracoa yet. I haven't tried the brisket. Because I was waiting for the salsa. That good. Man, we got a full spread here. We got a full breakfast spread. Mm -hmm. That tortilla is breaking. <laughs> OJ, what do you think of the tortilla, man? It's got butter on it. It's really good. Really I good think so. We have a uh, like a page here called RGB Restaurant Holics in the Valley, and uh, they voted Teddy's Barbecue Best Tortillas. I think, really, really yeah, I think so. It was at least up there, top really three good. for sure. Ahora el menudito. He put a lot of hominy, man. Which, yeah, buddy. Good, pero necesita poquita más sal. I like my menudo a little spicier with more uh, kick. This one's a little more in the middle. It's good. The pancitas are well cooked. They are? Mm -hmm. They're not too chewy. They're just right to go down. All right, what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to make a super taco. <laughs> I'm gonna put some barbacoa, chicharron. some chicharron, not egg, you don't get a well white. No, mira. <laughs> and you know what, I'm gonna throw in some beans right here. And then, because they brought us some of this stuff, I'll get some cilantro and a little bit of cebollita. Ah. And you know what, just for fun, a little bit something like that. I call this. Surge. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, buddy. That good. Hey, Lolita me hizo de todo. Let's check that out. Little mezcla. Yeah, buddy. Put the chicharron. So far, what's your, your favorite piece of the meal, OJ? Chicharron's been really Chicharron? Good. Yeah. Yeah, chicharron's legit, man. So, for breakfast, we were invited here by Adrian de Hoyos, who unfortunately could not join us today. Lo invitamos, pero he's a busy man. But when we got here, you know, they didn't even, they didn't even know the plate that we were talking about, right? Mm -mm. They actually mentioned Adrian by name. Ah, you're with the man from Donna. <laughs> you want the one that has a little bit of everything, right? That's the one. Yeah, because it seemed like what you ordered, Adrian, if you're seeing this, it's like a Thanks custom so custom plate. Thank Hasta le llamaron the Adrian. Ooh. There, it is. <laughs> there, we go. there it is. There we go. Right there. Yeah. That's a real tackle. That good? Very good. That was perfect. Yeah, man. Jesus. Dude, look at all the what I still have. I've been too busy recording, that's why. I think so. I stop recording and start eating. You're getting all the action shots. Yeah. The, uh, what do you call it? <laughs> Let's redo that. <laughs> all right, redo here. Yeah, redo yeah. number 34. What do we got, Tito? So this is going to be the encore, right? So this is, I ordered another set of torts just so that I can make uh, chicharron and, and chile taco. This is the encore right here. 
I'll tell you what, so far, I don't know how you all feel, but the Charon is a 10 out of 10, man. Yeah, it's fire. It's good, man. I usually it's like the very good. like real crispy and fried, mm -hmm. but it was really good. Especially if you try with those tostadas, you get the crunch and then the softness is really good. Mm. This has been my favorite so far. <clears throat> Oh, I'm still working on a little spot, bit of everything, man. <laughs> Mom's done with my beans. I'm done with potatoes. Mom's done with. Y'all got me brisket. I don't, I don't OJ helped me with the brisket. Yeah, yeah, that was OJ's good. done. I didn't think I could do another piece, but I think that one, that one capped me off. Right, there. that was good. The brisket's really good here. You know the barbecue? No, me gustó. You no le gustó OJ tampoco. You know, it was not Tino Tapoco. Nope. <laughs> Duh, you didn't carry me noodle, man. Too much. Highly I don't think that's a no. Can't, no power. No power. All right, Tino, I know that was ya. Yeah, we already cooled down. Food's long gone. The menudo's packaged. Mm -hmm. We got to give the ratings. It's time for ratings. So, first and foremost, uh, I mean, here at Teddy's, the brisket's always good. It's tender, smoky, you know. Um, but I think my favorite thing on the plate was the chicharron and salsa. I would give it a nine out of a 10. Uh, just had a lot of good flavor. Of course, wrapped in a fresh all beef fat tortilla. Hit the spot. Um, least favorite part of my meal with compared to everything, I would say would be the brisket. Not because it wasn't good, just because everything else kind of outshined um, the food. OJ. I think everything. Honestly, I think everything was really, really good. I think that I really liked the brisket. Probably one of the better briskets I've had. I'd give it a 10 out of 10. Damn. Uh, Chicharron was good. I, I didn't try the barbacoa, so I can't rate that. But for the chicharron, I would give it an 8 out of 10. Good deal. So for me, overall, man, I really, really enjoyed myself here. The service was excellent. They were super friendly, super helpful. The young lady that was helping us out the entire time um, was always checking up with us. She even brought Tino beans, a lot of beans, because his <laughs> plate initially didn't come with any. Um, but the chicharron was awesome. To me, the chicharron was either a nine and a half or a 10 out of 10. It's some of the best chicharron I've ever had. Like Gomez said, brisket's always on point here. But I'm not a big fan of, of briskets. It's just good. To me, it's either dry, bad brisket or good, juicy brisket. And this is good, juicy brisket with good bark. Uh, smoked barrocoa is very clean. I think we talked about yeah. how uh, most barrocoa places, like OJ's not a big fan of barrocoa mm -hmm. because uh, a lot of places don't really clean or trim their the fat on the barrocoa. Mm -hmm. This one's really clean, so it leaves a really nice, um, clean flavor, flavor without all the extra juice in the fat. Um, I guess if I had to pick a least favorite part of the dish, it'd be the potatoes. But the potatoes are simple, <laughs> but yeah. everything else was good, man. The menudo was good. Um, like I said, menudo could use a little more spice, but it, it was good. Uh, Charones was good. Brisket was good. Uh, Barracoa was good. So overall, the meal was about a nine, nine and a half out of ten. It's a very, very nice day out today. So it was a good stop at Teddy's. Yeah. Good. All right, y'all. Well, we are done for today. We had a great breakfast here at Teddy's. There wasn't a lot of people out today, which is really surprising, man. Teddy's is normally bumpy, and it's, like I said, it's one of the top barbecue places here in the valley, and for a good reason. Um, maybe it's the weather, maybe it's because it's a little rainy, and we're the few locals that are out here. But everything was good, man. Like I said, strong nine, um, close to a 10 out of 10. This breakfast was awesome here.